was like, excuse me, excuse me, ma'am. I'm teaching right now. Excuse me. Just you're gonna have to wait, please. <laughs> Talk to you tomorrow. Bye bye. Good morning, Box. Good morning, Box. How are you today? Good. I'm glad to hear that. Hope you're doing well. If you're not, I'm sorry to hear that. But hopefully, this vlog cheers you up. I hear congratulations are in order. Um, that's right. That's why I'm popping one of these babies open. Apart from your addiction. My, my carbon <laughs> orange delivered water. What, uh, what's so exciting? I got a thousand followers on Instagram. Finally, after, broke a thousand. I don't know how long. Yep, I posted it. He had 999. I took a screenshot and posted it. Who was your 1,000th follower? Number 1,000 was, let me go back. Let me see here. We got a lot very of excited. Since yeah, then. since then, a lot of people have wanted to be his 1,000th um, follower. Kel's photography. Yes. So... That's very exciting for you, Ken. I feel I feel very excited for Let's your check, accomplishment. You know what? Let's check my Twitter. It's probably just as awesome. Mm, I don't think your Twitter is going to be as satisfying. It's going to be awesome, Heidi. Let me check here. See? And you know what? We don't have to talk about that. We don't need to talk Let's about talk, Twitter. Let's talk about something else. Um, maybe if you tweet it every once in a while. Uh, so, it is one take day. Today is Thursday. And it was also date night. Mm -hmm. Did you have a good time? I did have a good time. You guys didn't miss anything, don't worry. But also, even if we were filming, you guys would stay home with Little Cub. Maybe, probably. No, it depends I actually had the actually. camera yeah. in my purse. <laughs> we just went to Applebee's. So. Yeah, which was marvelous. It was yeah. so nice to just be like, just the two of us. Mm -hmm. It was fabulous. A couple of our friends. Thank you. Thank you, friends. Uh, offered to watch Roslyn. And I think they might have heard yeah. us complaining previously about how we don't really do date nights in Tucson because all of our babysitters live in Phoenix and then they offered to watch her. So it was fabulous. It was we went wonderful. we went to Applebee's and then we went to Cold Stone and it was just like old times. Speaking of and old times. And we went to Hyundai. Yes. And they did not have the part for my car. Yeah, they have to order another new part. Because the guy who put in the order misunderstood what I needed and I looked at the diagram and I was like, this, this is not the part I asked for. I asked for this. And the guy was like, Oh, I don't have that in stock. It's 88 cents. <laughs> it's not, even, cent it's not even a dollar part, and he's had to wait like two weeks for it. Oh, my goodness. But the, the As a aftermarket... side note, tomorrow I really want to drive you to work instead of... I didn't drive him to oh, work yeah. today because I was babysitting, and we didn't have the Better other car seat well. in the car at the moment, and I needed to have the car. It did not go well to not have I'm it. sorry for that. And Rawson didn't nap today, so that was fun. Yeah. It wasn't fun. <laughs> it wasn't fun. But I did babysit, and it's kind of nice when I babysit because they play with each other. Mm. So, And they're at a really fun age. They were, like, playing chase and uh, actually playing catch with the oh, ball. Really? Yeah. Yeah, and they were actually catching, which was great. Um, As opposed to one of them just petting the other repeatedly. <laughs> yeah, or, like, or not playing. Oh, okay. You know, like, just playing by themselves. Like, they're playing with each other, which is great. I think it's great when they start to kind of play with each other. And, um... Play-Doh and blocks were much more creative than just, like, they were stacking and knocking things over. It was great. Um, in other news, that cricket is driving me insane. I don't know if you guys can hear the cricket. I looked for the cricket, and I found it. And It's in a secret compartment. It is. So our bathroom sink has a section under it, which is covered by a board. A lot of sinks have this build, but there's, like, a little crevice there and then it's hollow behind it. And, and so that's where the cricket lives. Okay, so I told Heidi The cricket that is the bane of my sleep. I cannot sleep. I I'm sorry. I told Heidi I was like, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go and get a tarantula. <laughs> and, just and just set the tarantula loose go, in there. Here you go. Actually yeah. I, I saw a spider that looks concerning in the door. So why what? Yeah, I mean, I meant to tell you about that. I've been sticking my fingers in that little gap. In this store. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. <laughs> and you know what else I saw today? 
um, was a snake skin. In the house? No. Okay. No, in the yard. Okay. I was like, why would we have... It was a tiny one. Uh, like probably, a baby snake. Probably a garter snake or something. Could have been a garter snake or a baby. You don't like snakes? I have a proper respect for snakes. <laughs> well, the thing is, things are poisonous here. That, no, that is true. <laughs> and so it's not it's not that I'm afraid of snakes, yeah. but they give you you know how you just kind of get that little heebie-jeebie. Yeah. And like, I generally people just respond that way to reptiles, and you probably get it too. You just work through it, no, which is yeah, how yeah, I, I am just, too. I'm like I'm reasonable. I know most snakes aren't dangerous. Well, and I don't I don't know what it's like in other parts of the country or the world even, but at least in Arizona, you actually have to teach you know little cub and the dogs and the dogs. Do not touch, don't touch the snake. It's yeah, actually, just, and our same very, with spiders. Just don't touch it. Like, our very um, first time walking Apollo, he was an itty bitty little puppy. There was a, a huge rattlesnake right in the middle of the sidewalk, and we didn't see it. And he stopped and he pointed it. He hasn't pointed anything since, but he pointed at it. <laughs> Probably because you, we don't and listen. We, well, <laughs> on one hand, I was like, well, if he hadn't been there, we would have stepped on it. But if he hadn't been there, we wouldn't have been walking. Who are we kidding? <laughs> But yeah, so th there are scary things that happen. Let's go to comments, shall we? Okay. <laughs> Nicole R wants to know where we got a little cub's Pete the Cat T-shirt. We got it from a place called I have no idea. We got it from a place called Gemma. Oh, okay. Uh, my mother bought it for her. I'm sure she got it on Amazon or something like that. My mom's a librarian. If you guys don't know that, so she loves Pete the Cat. Roslyn really likes Pete the Cat. Ken really likes Pete the Cat. If you guys don't know who Pete the Cat is, I highly recommend the book. Books. Yes. The book series. It is wonderful. Um, it's very groovy. It is groovy. Yeah, but I don't know where that shirt came from. We've had it for a while. Still doesn't quite fit her properly, but no. I put it on her anyway because it makes Which me happy. Which is amazing. Life. Yeah. But lately, she doesn't want to wear any, anything but dresses. Item. Yes. Yeah, and she's very specific about her dresses. Mm -hmm. It's got to be the pink dress or the Elsa dress or the yellow dress. Those are the only dresses she wants she'll to go, wear. She'll go into the drawer and, like, just, <laughs> it's the cutest thing. She's just out there. She's just, In the morning, she's just like, no, no, oh. Yellow dress and like runs over and is like, I want to wear this one. <laughs> My favorite the other day, she was wearing like this like blue tunic style shirt and then she had shorts on underneath it and then this big purple tutu that she picked all by herself. It's kind of cute that she's getting to like be able to pick be that out. age where yeah. she wants to pick things by herself, but it's also kind of frustrating because you know, laundry's a thing. Thank you for all the support, by the way, on finding that mosquito. Rosalind did not wake up with a mosquito bite. She did not. It's true. That's right. So I dealt Good with it. Good job, Ken. Way to Thank kill you. the mosquito. Yeah. We're yep. almost out of Band-Aids for the last mosquito incident. <laughs> Good. She used like 100 Band-Aids. <laughs> um, cheers for hugs and kisses from Little Cub. I have missed them. Well, part of the reason why we don't always do the hugs and kisses from Little Cub is because as adorable as it is, uh, when she kisses the lens of you... Your eye camera box. Um, it messes up the focus a little bit and well, makes it all smeary. Yeah. It a little yeah, bit. so if she goes for it, we let her kiss the box. But if she doesn't, we don't encourage her to do so. Um, side note, I got a stomach bug yesterday and I couldn't move. That sounds awful. I'm sorry, Casey Brown. Yeah, mine that was not as bad. I was able to move. Yesterday, today I, is yesterday, tomorrow, today is yesterday, tomorrow, yes, yes, that is correct, that is, yes, because you, you, right now, are tomorrow for us, yes. Yes, but while you're watching it. But while you're watching it. It's yesterday for you. Right. Um, yeah, apparently the bug would really bother a lot of people. I'm pretty proud of that hunt. How was work today, sweetie? It was quite good. Yeah, how did your, um, you have one minute, how did your uh, walkthrough thing go? Oh, oh yes, I had You this... didn't seem stressed when I picked you up. Yes, no, yeah, it went fine. Yeah, the state came through and it, it was really good. And awesome. They, they came in, <laughs> they happened to come in in a moment when I was just like in the middle of managing like six students simultaneously, which doesn't normally happen, but that's what happened at that particular time and they're like, Walk in, they went to ask me a couple questions. I was like, excuse me, excuse me, ma'am. 
I'm teaching right now. Excuse me. Just gonna have to wait, please. <laughs> and it was actually students are the priority here. But it was actually like legitimately like no 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 like for real. I, was like, I got my hands full. I'll answer your questions later and like come back later. That's funny. <laughs> but it actually worked out. It looked really good, you know. So I was like, yeah, all right, cool. So good. I'm happy. Did that pretty pretty well. I'm happy for you. Mm -hmm. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If uh, you want to see more of this, we do this thing. The, the, yeah, it's a one take. So, <laughs> so that's staying. We do this every single day. So we'll talk to you tomorrow. And bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.